Hello, this video demonstrates how easy it is to use your own fonts when producing PDFs with Scientific Word and Scientific Workplace. So let's start with the document to use. File, New Articles. Let's go down to Sequential Analysis Journal as an example. Now to see the typeset appearance, we would click on PDF Preview or Control shift p on Windows or Command shift p on a Mac. No surprises there. Uh, that's what the document normally looks like in the PDF. Let's close that and then show the changes. So to choose a different font, we click on Typeset, Document Format, and on the General tab, we select ZTEC, Z -Latec, in place of the classic PDF LaTeX. That's the first change. And then on the Fonts tab, we enable overriding of font selection. And I'll demonstrate this with the main font for the document. Let's choose one that looks very clearly different, the American typewriter, and select OK. Now, Control shift p Command shift p on a Mac. And here comes our PDF. Obviously, a different appearance using typewriter font. Let's close that and just demonstrate it again. Typeset, document format. On the general tab, make sure we're using ZTEC. On fonts, enable overriding font selection and choose the font here. Oh, if you want to know about the swash, you can read about that on Wikipedia. I'm going to choose here one of my favorite fonts, Comic, which is a sans serif font from uh, Microsoft. And so click on PDF preview. So, here again, a different variation on the PDF using that comic sans serif font. So hopefully that gives you lots of options for using your own fonts to make your documents more interesting. Hope that's useful to you. Thanks for watching.